Well, how y'all doing? Live Mega Productions, Fertile Ground, Great Beard, the more YouTube channel. Jaboy got a question he was asking me. A lot of people have been asking me this question, but Jaboy, what was it? What was your question? My question is, what do you think about Charleston White? Love him. Okay. Why? His courage and um, kind of knowing how to move on. Okay, Jay, this is why I like Charleston, this is why I like Charleston White. This is why I like him. He's good with his words. Yeah. And when I read the Husea, the Husea says that it is no match of the man who can, the man who knows how to effectively communicate, there's no match for that person. So it's like, I mean, like, and so, and so what I've been doing, Jay, is pretty much just watching that no one really coming up against him. They just, they don't say his name, but you know, I, I mean, and, and then another thing too, I, what I like about him, he's showing people who look like us how they look for real. And here's why he's doing it. I mean, here's one thing I like about it. Like people say, oh, talk to White, he'll call the cops on you, he'll snitch on you, he'll do this. I mean, but guess what? Be honest, okay, whoever said that, be honest, okay, for real, let's be honest. Open dialogue, and then I'm gonna let your boy keep asking. <coughs> if somebody was trying to kill you or murder you, wouldn't you want to get some protection too? And, and, and then another thing too, He's showing men how sensitive they are. Remember Ralph Trey's farm? You need a man with sensitivity, a man like me. See, soft and white is talking to people who have murders in their background, who have this in their background, <laughs> who have that in their background. And so he wonder how they could be out here trying to be leaders. And so he just pulling people cars. And I think for the entertainment purpose of it, Jay, because you know, we ain't for love, two peace, freedom, and justice. We never going to do the stuff that Charles and White do. But entertainment and listen to him. And sometimes saying, wow, incredible. I mean, I mean, not incredible, very knowledgeable brother for 44 years. Um, yeah, I like, I like Charles the White. He my brother. What you think about him, Jay? I mean, I, I, I like him. It has nothing to do with what he's saying as far as, you know, people think he's snitching. But what is snitching? For example, you're a drug dealer and you get robbed. Mm -hmm. Who are you going to call? Mm -hmm. If you go call the cops, then you're snitching. But he's a civilian. So if you come at him the wrong way, it's his right or his, you know, his belief if you want to call the cops. But I will call the cops too. I don't see anything wrong with it. A lot of people may not like his delivery, which in, sometimes his delivery seem harsh, but I mean, get your feelings out of it. Does it make sense what he's saying? Yes or no? You really sit back and attention to what he's saying. He's right. Who are you listening to? Here's one more thing I would like to say about Charleston right that I do like. Uh, and then I want you to, I want to hear what you have to say, Jay. I like how he tells the young, like the four, like, okay, people on the internet, right? Like we said, Jay, the youngest on the internet. Okay, so he on the internet saying, y'all better stop doing this drug stuff. He telling people about the orange flip-flops in jail and 23 lockdown and all, I mean, like, 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 like the scared straight type on the YouTube type of thing. I, I can appreciate that. And plus, here's another thing too, Jay. I'm 53, he's 44. So he's nine years younger than I. And I'm always talking about young dudes that they ain't really out here impressing me with their teaching the youngins how to be better people. So his approach, I probably wouldn't do his approach, but some of the stuff that he talk about, Jay, I'd be like, whoa. And then he, then here's what he does that I like, Jay, and which makes, which makes it different than a lot of other people. That me, see, you and I will agree with this. He's a fact producer. And everybody else just be just talking, you know what I'm saying? See, a lot of people just, okay, Jay, I'm gonna hear what you have to say after I say this scripture. Jay, put the scripture down here. Proverbs 3, 5. Proverbs 3, 5. I'm not a pastor. Y'all youngest need to know that scripture. That's what it say. Stop leaning on your own understanding. See, some of the things that you understand, like, I, if y'all didn't pay attention to our, to our, to our, our last 
series of videos we put up that y'all know what I'm talking about. Jabbar had something at the bottom where it was a circle. Watch this. We love this from Ray Hagins too. Shout out to Ray Hagins. I just do a circle. You see that? Pay attention. The space inside this circle. This hole right here. Not, not outside over here. Just what I'm doing. The space inside this circle represents your realm of knowledge. All the things that you know is right here in this circle. Okay? I'm trying to explain it. Everything that you know, everything, yup, is right here. Okay. Now, I'm gonna draw the circle like this. Do you know this stuff outside the circle that can change your life? Do you know this stuff outside the circle that can make your world better in the next 24 hours? So that's why we teach the way we do, because if you lean onto your own understanding all the time, then you're not gonna be able to get any new understanding. That's what I wanted to add, Jay. Mm. Another thing to his delivery is for shock value. He even say it. And, and it gets you to start listening. And guess what? I think he's funny. Some people may not think he's funny, but I think he's funny. Mm. But that's it. And you know what? If Charleston White see this video, how you doing, bro? My name is Gray Big. I love your videos, bro. I watch them all the time. And I wish you perfect health and peace all the days of your life, bro. Keep doing that community work you're doing and the, and the way that the all put you on this planet and where he placed you in Texas to do what you're doing. I'm watching all your videos. I'm learning from you, too. Shout out to Charleston White. And Jay, that's, all, that's what I think about Charleston White. Yeah. I don't know about a whole bunch of other ones though. Don't be careful to ask me about them, but Charleston White, yeah, I put a stamp on him. He don't even need my stamp, but hey, he, he got Jay, he got courage. Yeah. He got courage. And he doesn't want people and, and, and he doesn't glorify gangs and bullying and all the sucker stuff. Like I'm learning now that everybody who was a bully was really a sucker. Because if you're bullying somebody, that means that you're in constant fear all the time. Think about that one. Insecure. See you next video.